Hello again, fellow friends, and welcome back to this. Me checking to see if my microphone is working. It is excellent. Another ranked set. Except this time, as you may already know, based on the uh, thumbnail and, and everything, uh, I'm using Cetrion, a character I only picked up a couple of days ago uh, because I saw my boy Shujinki Dink using her at Combo Breaker. And he was using uh, the Force of Nature variation. Most people that were using her were using uh, Spring Cleaning variation, which is more about combos. Um, but Force of Nature seems to be more about zoning and playing Keep Away. So I made a variation. Wait, I forgot. Aaron Black. I forgot it was ranked. I was like, oh my god, where's my variation? Okay, so yeah, this is not quite the variation I've been used to playing, but it's basically the same thing. The only thing I'm missing here is the teleport. They, uh, they give you the, uh, the down back one rock thing instead of her wall, but I'd never really use her wall much anyway. I need to get used to using it because uh, you can crush and blow off it. And I'm probably going to miss her teleport, but she's all about frustrating the opponent into making a mistake. So I'm just going to keep doing this, bush, bush, and then it's not what I wanted to do, but it, I, I'll take it. I wanted to do that. Down, down, okay. And the combo I'm trying to do now... Damn, is that unblockable? I always forget to block the low meter burn bullets. I'm trying to do 2-1-2, two, because two, it's, it's actually safe on block somehow. This one. That's it, get away. See, right now, I would probably teleport to get out of the corner if I was using my variation, but I can't use my variation because they said, let's make ranked not as good as it could be. Have a starfish. Oh, I went straight through him. He managed to fire. He rendered the starfish nullified. God damn. Okay, let's see what happens here. Yes! Oh, come on! Did you see that? Oh, man. That's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Round two. Oh, damn. <laughs> I tried to go for the the uh, high boulder, but it's kind of hard. Because it, there's so much startup, you've really got to get going from when they're really far away. Get away from me! Oh, see, now I would love to be, be able to teleport, but I can't. Thank you. Ah, damn you, even though that's safe on block. Didn't even connect. I need to do this more. Nope, maybe not. <laughs> it didn't work. Um, I've got to stop doing her uppercut as well. It is the most useless garbage uppercut in the whole of history of uppercuts. Not even in this game. Just the history of uppercuts. It is the most useless. Because unless you're physically touching them, it'll miss. Right, okay, I don't think I'm going to be Cetrion for the whole set, because I plum forgot that you can't use your uh, custom variations in Ranked. Damn it. I am missing that teleport. And what else have I got? I've got the Boulder Delay. I think that's what this moves, this variation's got. It's got the Earthquake, it's got the Boulder Delay, and it's got the other move that I don't really use. But yeah, I missed the teleport in that match. I didn't think I would, but I did. Ooh, shit, look. Okay, Aaron Black. Don't make me be Sub-Zero. Don't make me be the character I love playing as. I hate fighting Aaron Black so much. Ah, oh, that move. And the... I always forget the meter burn bullets. Okay, I went for a move, but he was like, I'll beat you to it. I hate Aaron Black's dropkick and his slide, because it's like, ah, oh, you've got to have super fast reactions to react to it. Yeah, I remembered that time, didn't I? Finally remembered. Hup. Throw you again. <laughs> Is he just going to go for the drop kick again? Oh, he went for the jump that time. Oh, damn, wake up. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Into ground pound. We're getting teabagging for some reason. <laughs> I'm, I love Lena Cetrion, she just frustrates people. Oh, I see a starfish. 
I need to go get it. Look at him, he's like, I'll shoot your projectile out of the air. Because that's a thing that's, that's realistic. Oh, that one hit. Still, I was able to get him with the stagger. Ah, see, that one didn't hit. But of course it didn't, because I followed through. Damn you, Aaron Black. Yeah, I didn't follow through on that one. Boo! Ah, oh, the uppercut. So bad. No! Get off me with that. There we go. Completely wasted that. Damn. Damn, man. Ah, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. But it is what I told her to do. Oh, I thought I could... Damn. I thought I could block in time. There's obviously too many recovery frames on that. Um, fatal blow. Okay, then. I won't use Cetrion in ranked. Because the, they, they limit you to using variations that just make you feel weak and limited. I will, I will reserve her to the game modes where they allow you to have more fun. Oh, I've got an uphill battle against me. I've got to try and beat this guy through now. I have to admit that... That fatality is better than his two garbage fatalities from MKX, but not by much. I, I don't think much of it. The acid looks really weird and not realistic in the slightest, which is weird because everything else does. <laughs> okay, yes, I will select a new fighter. I think that would be a wise decision. <laughs> I will be Sub-Zero. Where are you? Sub-Zero. Sub no! My, oh my god. I did it again. <laughs> I did it again. I'm so used to just going XX to select my characters because that because I've got my you know f favorited variations on. Oh my god! And I just chose the wrong variation. I'm not totally rubbish with this variation, but it's not my preferred variation. It does have really good mix-up options, but I prefer having the zoning options. Quite frankly, this game is way more about zoning than MKX was. Yeah, flawless block, bitch. Another flawless block, bitch. Come on, Sub Zero, why didn't you do what I told you to? I forgot he doesn't have the slide. That's another reason I don't like this variation. Sub Zero without the slide is like, why bother? Oh, I tried to meet a burn, grab that interactable, but it didn't work. And I just. Oh man. I'm pressing buttons as if I'm in the other variation. It's not good. Oh, I should have hit confirmed it. And I know it! Okay, how did that get me? Damn. Oh, I tried to backdash. Shouldn't try and backdash against Aaron Black. Because he'll just get you with that crap. Okay, this round is yours, my friend. Can I neutral duck that? No, I can't. Okay, so I can't neutral duck it. And it shoots projectiles out of the air. I was going to say it's overpowered. But I suppose they do have to... Um, go into a stance first, don't we? God, I hate not being able to have the... I hate not having the slide. It renders that mix-up kind of not useless, but rubbish. What am I doing? Yeah, see, I'm, I'm doomed to fail, because I'm just in the wrong variation. I did press it. And I pressed it again! Okay, I guess the block button's broken. Oh, this is such a poor showing. It's not going to finish him. Yes! That's what I needed. That's what I needed. Okay, I'm not out of it yet. It's not over yet, Snake. Final round. Fight. Bro! Oh, let's see. Get out of here with your overheads. Boom! You didn't take that throw, did you? Oh yes, here we go. Boom! Oh, look at this. Look, he's not liking it. Oh, I nearly got a flawless on him. Yeah, eat shit, mate. That was a bit of a comeback in that fight, wasn't it? From the brink of death. 
Unfortunately, I'm now stuck with this variation until the set is over because you can only change character when you lose, and if I lose one more, I lose the set. Too hasty with my character selections. Sub -Zero wins. Go die. It's a shame I'll never really use Cetrion in ranked. I don't know why they had to ruin ranked. At first I thought making it best of three sets was going to ruin it, but I actually like it now. Um, but yeah, definitely limiting... Like making a game with this robust customization system and then just limiting that to certain modes. Round so one. dumb in my opinion. That's why I learned Sub-Zero's... Oh, that's why I main Sub-Zero's... Um, What's-it variation? Thin Ice. Because I wanted a Sub-Zero variation I can actually use in rank. And I refuse to use this one on purpose because it doesn't have a slide. Oh, God damn, I went low because he went low last time. Here we go. I only learned today <laughs> that Sub-Zero has a throw crushing blow. I never knew that. Okay. Everything Aaron Black does is too fast for Sub-Zero, apparently. Even when I delay wake up. That move. I think Aaron Black might be my least favorite character to fight against in this Round game. Two, He's just... Fight. Everything he does is just so annoying. No, I should have... Ah. Uh, hit confirmed it. See, that would have gone straight under that... That shot. If I was in the other variation, because it would have been a slide. Oh, I, oh, yeah, that's not, and that's another reason why that that cold shoulder is worse than the slide, because with the slide, the amplifier won't won't come out unless it connects. But but with uh, with a stupid cold shoulder, it'll just waste it for you. Damn you! Ah, oh, he went low that time, didn't he? Ah, see, I threw it away. I thought to myself, if he gets up and does anything other than block, this will win the fight for me. But it didn't. Maybe next time I'll actually choose the variation I use instead of accidentally choosing Dead of Winter. <laughs> and totally forgetting that, of course, I can't use my Cetrion variation because it's ranked. That was just... Not once did I pick the right character. <laughs> good game, though, even though it's... Yeah. It's a good fatality, though. It's pretty cool. I do like it. Thank you. Imagine. Getting me with those damn mix-ups. <laughs> right, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll actually be the right character this time. Uh, yes, ending game. Find next opponent? Yes, please. God damn it, man. Picking the wrong... Ugh. Just ugh. Well, <laughs> the thumbnail was going to be Cetrion, but since... I don't think it will now because I'm only using her once because she doesn't. She's got that crappy variation. I missed the teleport. I mean, then again, it wasn't. It wasn't really that bad, was it? It's only missing the teleport. So who knows? I may end up using her again. Oh, okay, cool. I didn't want to see that guy's win loss. That's fine. The game just goes here you go and then takes it away. So it's like okay, I can't see who I'm gonna be. Well, I, you know, I was toying with the idea of being. You know what, I'll be Noob. Baraka. No, I'll be Noob. noob Which one is it? Dark Sabbath? Yeah. I was toying with the idea Coliseum of being uh, Cetrion, but not if he's Jade. I don't mind being Cetrion against Jade with my variation, because I fought someone yesterday in King of the Hill, and he was Katana against everyone. And as soon as I picked Cetrion, he went over to Katana and then switched to Jade, and I was like, okay, he's obviously going for the counter pick against my zoning because of the purple move, and I still beat his ass. <laughs> Yoink! Ha! I never use that move and I need to utilize it more. Running man. Oh, I see how it is. Oh, I see. Oh, I forgot. This variation's garbage. I can't do that. I can't do the teleport in midair. This is why I don't like ranked, because all the characters are gimped. They're lame versions of what they could possibly be. They're just restricted. It doesn't feel good. I think that's why I'll just stick to Sub-Zero and Baraka. I mean, even Baraka feels gimped, because I can't use the blade charge. All he had to do was duck that. Yeah, okay. 
It looks like I may give up on, on ranked altogether then, because the only characters I'm ever going to use would be Sub-Zero and Baraka, and that would be boring as hell. Bosh. Oh, okay, I thought I was blocking, but I guess that move has unlimited recovery points. I'll throw this bucket of guts, but he'll purple thing. He didn't purple thing. Okay, now he will. I told you- oh, fucking hell, noob. Three times I went down up, and if he'd done it any of those times, I would have got him while he was trying to put the purple mist on. But the game was like, nah. You didn't press down up, even though you clearly did. Yeah, I might drop noob as well. I just don't like playing as it. Oh yeah, I need to use this one a bit more, don't I? Well, that was a waste of, of meter. Boom! Ah, oh, damn, I'm trying to time that. Okay, I did press jump. It's like, it's like everything has unlimited recovery frames on it. I'm like pressing jump. Doesn't work. Oh god. I said, fuck <laughs> off. Okay. I kind of don't want to win this fight because I don't want to be Noob Cyber anymore. He's just not fun to play as. Which is a shame. After I, I, I missed him in MKX so badly and I was like, man, I really hope he's in MK11. And now he's in and he's just not fun. This is what I was worried about with Sub-Zero. I was worried that I might not like using Sub-Zero. Luckily, I was that... Fear is unfounded because I uh, because Sub Zero is awesome on this game. Thank you. That's what I wanted you to do. It's always got his meter to break it. Damn you! Your air delay. Oh no, wiggle stick. God, I can't. <laughs> These rank variations of Noob Cyber are just fucking garbage. I don't like being Noob Cyber when you can't do the air teleport because you could in MK9. That's what made him fun to play as. So you could jump towards someone and make them think you're going to do a kick or something and then just teleport out the way. Can't do that anymore because they went, why would we allow the fun mode to be uh, used in, in ranked matches? Why would we allow that? So yeah, Noob Cyber off the table. Pro and probably not just for ranked. I mean, I might bust him out occasionally if I'm fighting someone. Sub -Zero. Like if I'm doing King of the Hill and I get bored of being Sub-Zero, Baraka and Cetrion. Maybe I'll do a bit of noob. I also kind of dropped Shao Kahn because he's garbage as well. Um, he's got great range, that is it. Um, I heard that he, he he needs some buffs and I agree, so I just don't use him anymore. I'll wait to see if they buff him because he's got that. His taunts are pointless because he does, he's got no move that allows you, that gives you guaranteed sufficient time to, to set up the taunt. So most of the time, if you do a taunt, you're just going to get messed up. Which is why most people don't use the taunts. Which defeats the point of being Shao Kahn, really. Especially in the variation where he's got two taunts. Okay, just gonna dodge all of my all of my moves. Get in the corner. Ah damn that guy. Damn. That move. Okay. That spinny move didn't go for anywhere near as long as I've seen it go in the past. I, I was ex I was waiting for the rest of that move to happen before I countered. Ah, oh, damn. Went straight into it, because he knew the roll was coming. Yeah, fuck you. Get screwed. Being Jade. Round two, fight. Thing is, though, I'm not like... I'm so over- why am I trying to throw projectiles out? I'm so over uh, complaining about Jade uh, being like zone heavy and stuff. Because that's- or at least uh, complaining about players just running away with her all the time. Because that's how she's meant to be played. She's designed to just be a runaway character. Plus, I now use Cetrion, so you know, I don't think I can complain about people using annoying characters. Go on. Yes, I knew you were gonna. How did? Okay. I've never seen 
I've never seen the slide connect, but the amplify not. That's a first. Bosh. You're getting the polar bear. There we go. That's what you get. When I actually choose the right character, I can win. <laughs> oh, man. He's going to stick with Jade. Fair enough. It worked against Noob Cybot. Not so much against Sub Zero. Round one, fight. Hep. Oh no. I thought he was just binding. Uh, binding? I thought he was buying himself time to do the uh, the purple move. Which, as far as I know, like I think it only has one frame of start. It's instant. Okay, I tried to do the slide, but I guess my inputs were sloppy. Are you gonna wake up? Nope. Damn, I hate it when they jump over the wall, man. Ba -ba 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 Boom. I love it when they jump into that. Ah, I thought he was trying to buy himself time. Ah, oh, damn it. I'm going to throw. Again, I, I keep missing... Again, I keep messing up the slide. I'm pressing back forward. And I must, it's like I'm... I'm not pressing back forward. Damn you! Ah, I know. I kept I kept trying to slide under his air glaives, but he was. But I guess you can't. So all I can do is stay at range, which is annoying because that's where Jade wants to be. Because she can. How many times? How many times did I tell him to do his breakaway? And he said no. Okay, I'm just gonna have to keep pushing you back to the corner. So you can't run away like a little bitch. He said, that's, what's going on with these slides, man? Boom, boom. Coming for you. Ah, oh, man, I tried to block low. Yeah, eat that. And he jumped over me, I tried to get for the uppercut, and he was like, nope. Yeah, eat this. And then I... Again, what's happening? My slides aren't coming out properly. They're connecting, but not properly. Oh, you shouldn't have done that, son. That was a mistake. Nope. <laughs> Missed that one up. Yeah. Eat this. That's what you get. Do you see, Carla? What you get when you mess with the warrior? He's making me work for it, though. To be fair to him, he's making me work for it. He's just staying away and throwing projectiles at me all day. What I'll try and do in, in this one is when he starts walking away and trying to throw projectiles at me, I'll just stand back and dodge them all. Because you can... Oh, I don't recall if you if you can duck under the air glades. That's a, that's a problem. I don't remember. So he's going to do his purple mist. Okay, so now he's immune to projectiles. So, can you duck under that one? You can. Okay, and jump over that one. Why am I doing that move? I need to get close. Oh, I see. I didn't realise the purple... I didn't realize the purple had um, so few recovery frames. I pressed L1 three times, oh my god. I, I, sometimes you just wonder if your controller's breaking, don't you? Damn that guy. Oh man, I jumped straight into it. So many times I'm telling him to do stuff and it's just not happening. I, I told him, I, I went under him and then told Sub-Zero to do the um, fatal blow. Sub-Zero was like, no. There we go, get back in the corner. Or just jump straight over my... I hate the range of a, of a star, it's so annoying. 
Okay, yeah, see, if I'm close enough, I can punish that. And then throw her right out of the corner, which is not where I wanted to put her, but I really wanted to get that crushing blow on. Thank you, I'll take it. Thank you, I'll take it. No! <laughs> How did that... Okay, whatever. Yep, went straight under the wiggle stick. So if I win this round, I win. I win the set. Yeah, that's what I want. Okay, here we go. No, that's not what I want. <laughs> Jump straight into it. Okay, I'm pressing down and block. It's just not working. That's not what I wanted to do, but again, it is what I told him to do. I'm going to lose this fight now because I'm shit. I was hoping he was going to jump. He never jumps when I want him to, and he always jumps when I don't want him to. Right, okay, so he can get up. Is he going to? He did. Yeah, eat that. Ah, oh, crushing blow. That's the first time I've landed that crushing blow. Nice. Nice. What a beautiful way to end the video. Nice. Boom, take that, you annoying ass. Again, you know, I shouldn't complain too much about him uh, playing in a really annoying manner because I now do it myself as Citrio, but not in rank match because they don't have to teleport. I could probably live with that though. I might use Citrion again in ranked, but I'm not using Noob again in ranked. Anyway, thanks for watching boys and I'll see you next time.